let's now create a test for the various types of beverages we have so i will create a test so php artisan make test and this test is for beverages beverage test and this is a unit test simple one let's go here and on this beverage test first thing we need to use the database migration so database migration is here and the test i'm going to create is like uh, beverage has name very basic test and we know we have to include test here this is good and let's run this test and we know this test passes because it's just asserting true as true okay so think about this first thing we need to create uh, beverage so this wins this is good then we need to get the name and then assert it assert but as we have decided in this episode we are going to use the model factories so you can see here on the database we have this folder called factory and user factory is given by the level out of the box what it does it just create the fake details for your database or the migration you will create and then you can use these fake things to just test your codes so let's now create a new factory but we know we also want uh, apart from factory the model for the beverage so why not create the model so php artisan make and model and by the way if you are not familiar with this alias i have created just check out the alias video on the link in the description so make model and model name is beverage and we want a migration and we want factory also so giving the flag of hyphen mf so you can see factory migration and model is created so let's go firstly to uh, this uh, migration and here in the migration first thing first we want uh, a string as a name then the type which type of beverages we have like uh, do we have a soft drink do we have an alcoholic drink do we have a juice uh, like that so simple two things name and type so that's the migration but what about the factory hmm so we know we have to give the name and that name can be a fake name and we will use faker library and if you don't know how you can use the faker library so go to this uh, faker level and uh, this is the first uh, github repository which actually uh, level uses so here what we need uh, here we have yeah so we just want a simple word so that we can use so faker word this is good and the name is defined but the type has to be something like uh, we can say soft drink simple one so let's see this thing in action so here we are going to use or we are going to create the uh, beverage but now we are going to use the factory instead of directly using the model so factory for which model factory for our beverage model so beverage then class and we can simply say here uh, make and let's create two of this so this is good and this actually is beverage and here we can get the name so name is equal to beverage arrow name we want and now we are going to assert so this arrow assert uh, equals and it's not equal assert uh, assert assert not empty type of thing so so name does not has to be empty so run this test and it fails why it fails let's see the result and yeah that not work that word so i think you have prompted that so once more run the test and this time it says property name doesn't exist on the collection that is because we are creating two so let's create only one and this time yeah it passes because name 
has some value it's not empty so this is simple thing so let's create a new test which is just going to test that also has type so beverage has type and we will create that so instead of using name we can just use type here and now run the test it passes that means it has some value so i'm giving typ some kind of things it fails yes you don't have this this kind of attribute now let's just clean things so here you can see we are using this so why not do this in line and here and like this also so this is good remove it and now run this test good run this test good and if you want to run all the tests for this class just click here inside the class not any inside any function and hit run and to test to assertion passes everything but again we can do another cleanup things so you know if you can go to this test case here it extending this test case so let's go to this one you can see we have this setup method which just do these things before running any of the test so we can use this thing so how we will use actually we are doing same thing on both of the test so why not remove or uh, make these things a little bit cleaner so why not create a function so public function and this is setup so we will call parent so like parent setup so that everything else will be included here and let's create a private beverage so uh, beverage and here now i will say this arrow beverage is equal to all these things inside the factory so remove this and make it here and let's just remove this from here also and this time this is not just a beverage it's with dollar this arrow beverage and now if i run the test you can see it passes and let's pass everything so two test two passes and we have clean up our test class very much one line assertion nothing else so this is good with factory and in the next episode we will try to do login system that means user need to log in to access some protected things so if you have not subscribed to this channel please go and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon because level knowledge never ends here and like bit films on facebook twitter instagram linkedin and we will meet in the next episode till then don't forget to share these video with your developer friend bye bye